<laughs> I'm crying. <laughs> it is snowing, guys. It's wet snow, but it's <laughs> kind of like. I even do. Is it recording? Hi. Hi. Oh, Hi. oh, you just started vlogging. Yeah, I'm vlogging daddy. Hi. What well, I'm gonna do back to No, go over there. Go over there. If they see double, double trouble. Double trouble. <laughs> go over there. Jerry, stop that. <laughs> Stop that, Derek. Go okay, there. Derek, stop it, please. Stop. Stop that. <laughs> Go over there. <laughs> My gangs. Smiley gangs. <laughs> Oma, Appa! Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my no. One day. Yeah. One day. Yeah. No, never go to Korea. Why? You guys are not allowed. <laughs> you guys are never allowed to leave us in the house. Well, we didn't say we would leave you. One eternity later. Hi guys. So I'm um, going to show you guys um, how I organize my shipping supplies. I think I showed you this um, drawers. I tripped this at Value Village for a good price. Um, yeah, I cleaned it up really good because when I got this, it's just um, dirty, have, you know, not stains, but stuff in the drawer. So I have to sanitized really good but it came out you know like it's good now it really works for what i'm using it right now for supplies and also this um metal shelf thingy or tray is drifted as well at value village so you can find a lot of like organizers at the drift store if you just know what you're looking at but yeah they up price sometimes but you have to watch out for um um these things sometimes if you're a reseller but anyways um let's start off at this top here i featured this all um in my haul video or i talk about them before but i just don't know which um video over here on the top i just have this um painting thing I made that and this is from anthropology it's supposed to have like an um, this is a diffuser but I don't know I can't decide whether I'm gonna put something in it like a fragrance oil or something like that but I'm keeping it like that just for decoration for now this sanitizer needs refill but still have a little bit left on the top over here are my expense receipts I keep them um, by month this is from March I haven't done my tax uh, receipts or add them all up the total um, I don't know I just got busy um, by March and I didn't have the chance to do it even well April is ending soon so I might do them both together March and April so I might do that like a couple months and then I'll do it. So at the end of the year, I'm not like scrabbing and uh, getting all my receipts and it's just 
you know, too much. So over here, these are from Dollarama, by the way. <laughs> this plastic um, envelopes. I love to organize them. You could use them for money, um, money, <laughs> money envelopes for budget. <clears throat> excuse me, budget things, but I don't do that. Um, I put my poly mailers. These are my new poly mailers. I go to, with this. It's the cheapest one I could find off Amazon. They are cute though and very um, gender neutral. <laughs> if you are, if there's like a guy shopping on in your closet or Poshmark or wherever, eBay, whatnot, um, it's pretty, but I mean, it's not pink, so it's okay for, you know, and more gender neutral is this one. I was just trying this out. I bought this off um, Dollar Tree, I think. Yeah, it came in a pack of three, and I haven't used any one of them, so I'm keeping this just in case. And I have some few cute ones that I'm saving for when I get like a special purchase from someone. And I have bigger ones too over here. Um, if I sell like medium bags that can fit there as well, I will use that. Just wrap it with bubble wrap and stuff so it will fit in there. And first drawer just clips more um, refill for my tape my tape um, thingy is in my desk um, some post-its my thank you stickers are here clips staples um, refill more post-its and what else is in here anyway so that's that for the first drawer. Here I have pens. So the third drawer is just um, Ziploc bags for my inventory. So I have small and this one for just one top. I like to organize them in a Ziploc bag before I sort them. In their designated bin it's either here or there's some bins in our garage over here more of those um, envelopes that I talked to you guys about cutting board if I need to oh I love word search so I bought this one but I still have one book uh, word search in my car it's nice to have when you're waiting I'm waiting for my kids to get out of school I like to have them so okay the next drawer it's just paper the tissue paper these are the leftover from christmas um some twine sometimes i go like nice on my packaging so i use twine just to make it more bougie the last drawer is just tape so just tape for packaging if i do boxes over here is packed of tools okay tools that i use almost all the time so lint from shein i bought this the this one you have to get this is good for sweaters um, yeah, I can't say anything bad about this. Just get it. It's worth $3 in my opinion. This one I haven't used yet. It's for shoes. So I want to try it when I drift something like Uggs or whatnot. Maybe soon. I don't know. We'll see. Um, this is for shoes as well. I haven't tried it. But uh, yeah, from Shein. Dollarama has... I only get Dollarama, this lint roller. This is a good one too. I have the reusable one, but I I think I, I like using this more. Steamer, I'm not gonna pull it out. Um, extra tape gun. I don't know why I have extra, 
because I I thought that I only bought one. Um, I don't know. Maybe my husband um, got this from work. I don't know. Um, my favorite downy wrinkle releaser. I bought the mini one because they I can't find the bigger the bigger bottle of this. I don't know if they dis discontinue or not. And also, most important is my defuzzer. Best, in my opinion. Um, I have a tagging gun. When uh, this is um, cool, if I want to tag clothes for like garage sales and stuff, those stickers, the price stickers, they don't stay on clothes. So it's better you tag them if you're doing garage sales. I'm planning on doing garage sale this summer, especially like clothing, um, children's clothes. So hopefully I can use that as well. Um, yeah, there's more underneath, but they're just whatever. Um, but I keep them there. Or I just pull them out and when I need to repair something. Over here, I put my thank you cards. I only include thank you cards when there's like a bigger amount of orders. Um, if just one top that's like $20 or less, I just put a thank you sticker. Wrap it, wrap it up and that's it. I Like you get what you pay for. Um if you spend more than fifty dollars i will pay attention on my packaging <laughs> if you know what i mean um this is for um kind of like a bean bag you heat it up and yeah i use this for when i have um pms <laughs> i have a black uh, mug here I don't know why. I think I'm planning on painting it, but it didn't happen. Uh, this one, uh, I have a bunch of little things there. A uh, little rosary. Um, I think my mom gave this to me. That's why I'm keeping it here. Um, so, yeah. Um, stationaries. I thrifted this. I'm keeping it because I just love the pattern. Um, wax set. I haven't used it, but I'm going to. I'm just, I'm just waiting for the time to, maybe Christmas time, but I thrifted this after Christmas, so there's no point. But we'll see. Uh, I want to use the wax thing with this. Um, stationary set I was planning so we'll see <laughs> and then over here the last drawer well it's on the top we're just going from there to on the top so this is the last one um, a label um, thermal labeler um, paper some stickers postcards stickers um, what is this um, paper clips, washi tapes, wash different kinds of washi tapes. Um, at the back is a. All these are different kinds of buttons that I thrifted. It's very handy if I want to repair something, missing buttons, or I want to replace buttons. I have to find. That's the closest to match the buttons. Right here, I'm keeping all the tags. I don't know why. I will, I will toss them, but I don't know. It's kind of like an obsession that I have to keep them all. I I don't keep them all seriously. And then some gift stuff there. And that's about it. And I'll show you where I keep the like boxes and stuff. So, some of the supplies, I keep them in the box, so I just pull whenever I need. I have this pulley bubble pulley mailer here, too. A more bubble mailer, <laughs> bubble stuff. 
um here are some boxes that i got from amazon from costco from wherever that i could find <laughs> um my family always save boxes for me and my husband saves some boxes from work so yeah becoming i save those too i recycle them so yeah becoming more and more um like using boxes to to mail out stuff it's more eco-friendly to reuse boxes so yeah